Oh, we're here at the RFP dinner with Jay Jay. Jay. We're here at the RFP dinner with Henry Ong. Kumusta naman ano? Thank you for the steak ah. Okay naman, okay naman. Okay na, okay na. Live ba yan? Live? Oh, live na to. Live na tayo, live na tayo. Oh, one tip lang, one tip. One tip lang. Sa mga nagsisimula sa ano. Wala talaga? Wala talaga? Oh, sige, 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 sige. Okay. Live talaga tayo. Oh, live na tayo. Okay, game. Hello, sir. Hi, guys. Hello, how are you? Welcome to RFP. Thank you for joining us here and for subscribing with us. Okay, pakalala ko muna. My name is Ryan Devera from Wealth Builder Asia. Ryan Devera, Wealth Builder Asia. Okay. Sama natin si Wealth Archie. Sama natin si Cardinal. Pero why are we here today? What's the... We are here today kasi, we are here tonight kasi nagkaroon ng parang thank you dinner si Henry Ong, the president. Oh my, pero no tips eh. And founder of RFP. I was waiting for some tips eh. Tip lang for you to... Uh, in building your wealth, what's important is the habit more than the amount. You need to start now. You don't. It's time to execute. Start uh, investing day in, day out, and just keep on on, on doing this. What's What's a good amount to start to invest? Good amount to start. Start with kung ano yung kaya mo. Simple mo sa one thousand. One thousand. Okay. Pwede tayo, whatever you're comfortable with. Importante kasi dyan yung, um, yung habit of investing. Okay. Eh. Kasi di ba, naririnig natin ito sa ibang experts that uh, financial planning is 80%. May naman ako ah. Okay naman ako. Ako din eh, tapos na. Is 80% behavioral and 20% technical. So, kung tutusin, uh, managing your money requires a lot of habit. Okay. Alright. So, if I'm... How old are you? 37. 37 years old? Yes, mukhang 27. Single? Then married. Happily married. Happily married. One wife? One wife. Okay. One and only wife. Hi, Han. If you're listening. Sa business mo, how do you allocate money to your expenses? Sa business, kailangan meron kang sunding budget. Very important yan. And as much as possible, keep your expenses low. Hanggat maaari to study every expenditure. Pero how do you do it? From what you earn in your business, how do you put money to your personal? Hindi, kailangan mag-assign ka ng salary. Ah, so you put a salary. Kasi when you have a partner, dapat meron kang salary, tapos may dividends ka in the end. Okay. That's how it goes. So how do you allot your salary from 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 the business? Ah, yung yung earnings. Okay, lamba, you're you're okay to. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, yung earnings ko normally I I keep it in some in some jars, no? Because it's important. Yung 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 habit is important. But for example, I'm I'm planning to start. Yeah, so photographer ako. I want to start my own photography practice. How how do I decide what salary I put? Ah, uh, ang pwede mong gawin would be to allocate. Like what, like what you said, may partner ako, partner dalawa kami sa photography business namin. Ang gawin mo kasi kailangan kasi mag magsweldo ka talaga sa sarili mo. Halimbawa, kumita kayo ng 10,000 for this gig or for a certain event. Okay. Mag-allot ka ng or sige, for example, yung yung 5,000 sweldo natin, hati tayo, tig 2,500, 2,500 yung 5,000, pwede nating paikutin to buy new equipment. Ah, so 25 per, that's an idea. Yes. 25, 25, 50. It depends eh, on case-to-case -case basis yan. Depende sa iyo kung how you plan to deal with it. What's important is you you just keep on on setting aside money. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So, okay. so, very important to set a specific amount. Okay, tapos, yes. uh, from your business, do you, is it advisable to give dividends quickly? How, how often? Yeah, to give dividends. Do you advise to give dividends when you're starting or... How, how does it normally go? It depends if you think that you need to expand your business. It depends on where your business is. Eh. Kung talaga kailangan mo mag-expand your business, you, you might have to do some trade-offs. Eh. Hindi ka muna magbigay ng dividends. Pero at the same time, para makompensate ka, set a certain salary para rin ganahan ko to work in the business. And eventually, di ba, it's either you sacrifice now and earn a little a, a more, and sacrifice a little now, or sacrifice now and earn more later, or enjoy already now, and sacrifice later. Diba? What are you spending this Christmas na luho? Spending this Christmas na luho. By the way, guys, uh, dami niya sports car. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Oh my gosh. Aula, <laughs> <laughs> I plan to ano lang. Siguro isang road trip lang. Oh, lang. Wala naman nanonood sa atin. Wala naman. Tayo lang, tayo lang. Tayo. This is not yet live. Road, okay. road trip lang. Road trip lang. Yeah. In your what car? Basta road trip okay, lang. Road okay, trip. Road trip. <laughs> okay. Biggest financial mistake in your life? 
biggest financial mistake in my life was... Sa akin, hindi ko nabasa yung Ready to Rich vlog eh. Kaya I should have started uh, yung, reading when it. I, ano, when I went all out kagad doon sa printing business ko na okay. hindi ko naman nabawi talaga. Parang mag, uh, I bought a machine na uh, hindi ko masyado pinag-isipan na ma-obsolete ma- pala siya kagad. So, hindi advisable to go all out? Hindi naman sa hindi. Uh, you have to weigh the consequences. Eh. Kailangan din alamin mo ng mabuti yung pinapasok mo. Sa, sa love, okay lang mag-all out? <laughs> okay lang, okay lang. Okay lang. lang. mo. Pero sa, sa, bis- sa, sa business? Sa business, ano, it, it depends. It depends. The best MBA answer, it depends. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so we talked about your spending, we talked about your biggest business mistake. Uh, if you could start things all over again at 20 years old, what would be the first investment that you would ever make? I would study, uh, I would, uh, aralin ko yung stock market kagad. Stock market? Yes, so, kasi parang business din siya eh. Okay. Di ba? I- nag-expect ka rin ng return at some point. Importante mag-start na kagad as, as early as possible. Invest ka. Make the money grow, make it work for you, understand. So invest first in the stock market. Uh, ako yun ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. based on okay what lang. I've learned. Yes. Okay lang, okay lang. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, I guess that's it. Yes. Any, any, anything that you want to add to find to end this? Uh, catch me at Wealth Builder Asia. I'll be yeah. launching a, very, a new program very new soon. Program. I'm excited. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much. Uh, Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas guys. Yeah, Merry Christmas. So we're here at uh, Ortigas now having some Christmas Christmas dinner. Oh, oh. So, kumusta ulit tayo? <laughs> ano mo? Ano? Ay, wala na naman. Okay, okay. Okay, now we're here with Mr. Fitz Villafuerte. Uh, a guy who earns Hello. millions per month sa vlog. Oh, hindi naman. Yeah. Okay. Mamamaya. Sige, introduce yourself. Take uh, yourself pala, self. Hello everyone. Uh, I'm Fitz Villafuerte. Uh, Award-winning vlogger. <laughs> the the founder of... <laughs> Ganun ba? <laughs> the founder of uh, the blog Ready to Be Rich and uh, also one of the directors of Wealth RT Incorporated. Okay. Uh, biggest, what's your biggest financial mis- mistake in your life? How old uh, are you? Interview by- ba to? Oh, how old, how old are you by the way? How old are you? Uh, old enough. <laughs> old enough. <laughs> I'm 40. 40? Yeah. Uh, in 40 years, what was your biggest financial mistake? Not investing early enough, Not <laughs> I would say. No? Okay. Because uh, sinabi ni Ryan kanina that if he would have started na 20 years old siya, he would have invested in stocks. Eh. So if, exactly, if, yeah. If it were you, where would you have started? I would also have invested in stocks. Talaga? Oh, kasi I started the stock market at 24. Oh, stocks, stocks. Uh, well, I... I, I, it's not a regret. Okay, oh, I would have took up RFP early years. Ha? Okay, tapos, tapos. For me, it was not a regret because talagang in-enjoy ko yung unang sweldo ko nung nagtabawa ko. But uh, if I were to do it again, I would have allotted a few of my, uh, a portion of my income back then to buying stocks. When, when did you start investing? What year? Uh, 2000 something. 2003. 2003, so uh, 14 years of investing. Yeah. Uh, uh, so in your 14 years of investing, masasabi mo ba na sulit na yung returns also? Oo, oh, oh, kasi kahit na anong down ng market, hindi ako nagde-negative eh. Oh, big because, because your well, base is very big? Uh, no, kasi ang tagal ko na nagsimula, yung talagang tumaas, nagsi- nagkaroon na ng significant growth yung mga stocks ko. So kahit na mag, uh, bumaba siya, kahit na mag, uh, tawag rito, magkaroon ng uh, slowdown in the economy, and mag- hindi, hindi siya umaabot sa previous price kung saan ko siya binili. Okay, head to head, hmm. stocks or mutual funds? If you'll pick, if you'll pick one. Stocks ako. Stocks? Uh, stocks or real estate? Hmm, depende kasi sa objective mo. No? Okay. Uh, if I want passive income, sa real estate ako. Okay, yeah. real estate starting your own blog business. Starting your own business, I'm always, ano, I'm an entrepreneur by heart. Okay. I am more an entrepreneur than an investor, I would I would say. So the business always wins for me. Business always wins. <laughs> what, biggest bi- business mistake ever? Um, ano ba? Not, not, uh, not knowing when to close a business. Ah, bakit? Bakit? Oo. Bakit? Uh, dati kasi, ang, panga, ang, ang notion ko is a business would be something that you can run forever. No? And, uh, I love life din ah. Oh, oh. Pero para sa akin yung pala, a business, uh, meron din siyang end. So it's either you pivot or you grow. Okay. And when when it's time to grow, sometimes hindi ka na 
it's not you you're not anymore the right person to grow the business so i medyo medyo malalim yung ano but uh, for example uh, I, i used to have a computer shop computer shop uh, kasi do, do, Capit- tahan, no? capital for computer shop magkano dati when i started 250,000 250,000 uh, yeah. ROI mabilis mabagal ba, ma, mabilis after 4 months ako na agad yung months. ano ko do you uh, suggest for people na interested sa computers to go into a computer shop business lalo na parang on e-gaming is becoming a big thing in the if, if if they have the market la go no ang ang sa akin kasi is instead of thinking of what business to put up you have to first ask yourself anong market yung gusto mong i-serve Yun yun. You, you always start with your customers. Sino ba yung customers na nasa paligid mo? And then give what they need. Rather than thinking of ano ba yung business na gusto ko. Tapos, tsaka ka maghahalap ng customers. Okay, so why why did you say na dapat sinara mo na yung... Uh, ah, hindi. What, what ang nangyari doon is, um, mahina na siya, pero I still try to uh, continue with it. Looking back, what I would have done was, found uh, I, I should have looked for a partner who would be willing to grow the business kasi by the time ano eh uh, yung gaming mismo medyo mahina na so nung it was too late when i realized that dapat nagpivot it nagpivot siya into another type of business so which personally hindi ko na siya kayang gawin so when i when i sold the business actually i didn't close the business i sold the business sold the business yeah i sold the business to someone and that someone na pa na continue yung business uh, it's now a business center as in photocopy center etc so what, so you earned pa when you sold the business hindi na hindi na yun yung sabi ko na when i realized that this is something na i cannot continue anymore i should have sold a portion of the business or hired a CEO or someone who to grow the business as ako nasa background na ako it's just like sabi na natin di ba si, si Steve Jobs dati there, there came to a point na nawala siya sa Apple tapos it just continued if they know the ano the movie in the intern mm, mm. Uh, that's that's a very good uh, that's a that's what I am actually t- t- uh, talking about no si si Anne Hathaway mm-hmm. saka si Robert ah. De Niro the intern na hindi yung the internship mm-hmm. na comedy yung the intern yeah, yeah. kasi yung business ni Anne Hathaway na online fashion store okay. it was really growing okay. and she couldn't handle it anymore and uh, the best advice that Robert De Niro said to her, to her was um, yeah Hire a CEO. Let the CEO run your company. So, yun yung sinasabi ko. Na, okay. Uh, business or Forex trading? Business pa rin. Forex trading, Bitcoin trading. Forex trading. That, why? Why? What's your take on Bitcoin? Scam Bit- or... Sc- uh, the, the next big currency or a flop? Uh, unstable kasi yung Bitcoin. What? what I like about Bitcoin is the technology. Yung blockchain technology, yun doon ka mag-invest. Okay? Kasi it will have a lot of applications. I already have friends who are uh, creating apps and services based on the blockchain technology on which Bitcoin was built. And doon ako excited. Uh, investing or putting money on Bitcoin, it's already very risky. Uh, even if... Ba- bubble, yes or no? Uh, yes. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, sabi yung Liza Salonga, inspiration ka daw niya. Ah, I love Torres. that movie, yeah. Tapos, I love that movie. Tapos sabi, Josh Campos, idol ka daw niyo. Ah, oh, so, say hello to Josh Campos. Okay. Hello, hello everyone. Hello, everyone. <laughs> so, what else? What else pa? So, uh, okay, so Bitcoin, blockchain. Blockchain uh, technology is uh, the future, no? For me. And uh, they should watch out for the apps or the services that will come out of that technology blockchain. dun sila mag-invest cashless society agree disagree I agree agree yes why why uh, it's so convenient okay. <laughs> and uh, it it gives people an easier way to track their expenses which is good no just like me uh, i'm almost cashless cashless Lagi, no uh, cashless wala naman yung wallet oh cashless yung I, i have i actually have usually i have 300 pesos lang sa wallet ko oh. because yeah i make sure na Uh, I use credit cards. So, pagdating ng credit card statement ko, I, I already have a list of my expenses. Alam mo yun, it's so easy to 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 track your expenses through that, no? Tapos, yun nga, um, if you have a cashless, ano, hindi ka masyadong 
maghanap ng ATM, maha para mahold up, alam mo yun, you don't need to bring a lot of cash when you're going out. I'm, I'm, I'm sure madaming gusto malaman to, paano maging magaling na vlogger na earning piles and piles of cash from vlogging <laughs> template, hanapin yung website niya, very very good vlogger. Pag ano, pag, if you want to become a vlogger, kailangan madaldal ka, no? kasi dadal ni Marvin. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> ko, I'm not a good vlogger nga, wala nga, last update, October, sorry ah, sorry, sobrang busy ka kasi masyado. Sobrang busy lang, oo, oh, oh. pero, Paano? How? How? Uh, How? What's, your, what's your secret sauce? Um, you have to remember that you don't need to be a good writer to be a good blogger. You just need to be a storyteller. So, and what story are you going to tell? You tell your own story. So that will uh, help you, alam mo yon, uh, express yourself better because you're telling your own story. Hindi mo kailangan magimbento. And you just read a lot. Because reading will eventually improve how you write, and uh, you you read the mga similar. Ready to be rich, no? I think that's a good book. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, or, or if you're, you know, if you're, if you want to be a travel blogger, they read a lot of travel blogs. You'll you'll see a lot of uh, the mga styles nila ng writing, etc., which you can eventually adapt to your own style of writing. Nas kwento lang, kwento lang, and be consistent. It doesn't how, have how to be frequent. How often do you write in a month? Ikaw, how often do you write na? I write uh, two articles a week. That's my... Huh? Yeah. Na yan naman. The important thing kasi is you have to be consistent. Consistency is more important than frequency. If you can only afford to write once a month, that's okay. Just But be consistent na once a month. Six weeks na yata ako di nag-update. <laughs> I have a tip for you, Marm. If you want to to be more consistent oh, sa, dan, dan sa article. Oh, dahan ako yung mama ni Pano. No. <laughs> Uh, you you write uh, an article, yung skeleton, tas hire a writer para gawin siyang article. Kasi that's what I actually do. 199 jobs. Yes, yes. Oh. What I do is, if I have a topic in mind, I write all the, yung mga main sentences, the main thought, the, the, the lesson that I want to impart in that article, and then I hire a writer okay. to make the article. So, after three, four days, I have the article, I review it, I polish it, I put in personal examples, then I now have an article at less time. Dati kasi, I write one article, I would write for three, four hours. Okay. Ngayon, just writing the topic sentences would take me around 30 minutes. And then, yung polishing ng article na binigay sa akin, that would take me another 30 minutes. So, in an hour, I already have... Ano mas madaling gawin? Vlogging or blogging? Mas madali ang vlogging. Mas madali ang vlogging, okay. Yeah, para sa akin, no? Uh, kasi, pag vlogging or video vlogging, you have to also invest on your... Kung ano yung tsura mo, kasi hindi ka pwedeng uh, hey, nakapambahay, di ba? Ako, ako problema ko, hindi ako guwapo, kaya hirap na hirap nga ako sa mga vlog na yan, eh. Kaya, yeah. ano, ano, eh. Meron kaming YouTube channel ni Renzi, di ba? Wealth Archie! So, Wealth Archie. Yeah. Uh, ang experience ko, mas mahirap mag-video vlog because you have to learn how to edit videos. Um, mabagal din minsan mag-upload ng videos. And we have to be, well, of course, conscious din sa, sa itsura namin pag okay. nagawa vlog. But uh, vlogging, yun nga, um, it's something that you can outsource the articles. Siyempre sa vlogging, sa video vlogging, kailangan ikaw yung nagsasalita, di ba? <laughs> what, what's, a, what's a good amount that can, people can earn from ads, Google ads, na pag nakuha nila yun, parang ano na siya, parang acceptable, average uh, earnings. $100 a month, that's the, that, that's the first uh, benchmark that okay. you should work for. So when you dollars uh when once you are you can consistently earn one hundred dollars a month, I would say that you're already there, no? And uh, don't give up because once you are able to earn a hundred dollars a month from blogging, the next hundred dollars would be easier. And before you know it, you'll be earning one thousand dollars a month, and uh, then it would be five thousand dollars a month and ten thousand dollars a month. Wow, ten thousand dollars a month, okay. US. US. <laughs> Okay, uh, bago tayo magtapos, anong gagasin si mo this Christmas? Biggest splurge? Uh, out of town vacation. Out of town vacation. Yes. Okay, last. And a down payment for a property. Down where? Secret. Secret pa. Okay. <laughs> Final tip for people who are into investing or uh, planning to invest. Uh, have a goal in mind. Have a goal in uh, mind. That's very important. Kasi marami tayong tips kung anong bibilhin. Pero wala tayong tip kung kailan natin ibibenta yung bibili natin. So, okay, okay, okay. Uh, once, once you have, if you have a financial goal in mind, you'll know exactly when you should sell your investments. Okay, so, very, very That's good. why you should have a, a goal before you invest. Very, very good. Okay, right. thank you so much, Mr. Fitz Villaferte. 
Okay, we're still here. Hello, hello. 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 <laughs> Any, anything you want to discuss for today? For today? Yeah. <laughs> Merry Christmas and Happy New Year uh, to all. Renzi is from year. Philam, from Tami. Uh, any mutual fund <laughs> tips for uh, uh, people planning to start? Uh, you can start with mutual funds for 1,000 pesos. 1,000 pesos? Yes. But what, what's the best mutual fund that you will advise as, at, at this point in time? One year horizon, 100,000 100, huh? pesos extra. Uh, one year horizon? One, one year, one, they can put it in for one year, <laughs> tapos they'll leave it for 20 years. Uh, ano na yan? They can go for the equity index fund. Okay. Kasi right now, maganda yung performance ng uh, equity index natin, the stock market. So okay. yeah, they can go for it, for starters. So 1,000 pesos. Personal preference, VUL or buy term and invest the difference? Depends on the budget of the person. Yeah, for you, for you. Huh? On your own, for your own personal investments. For me? I have VUL and I have ano eh, term eh. Okay. <laughs> so I have can, If you can rank them, what will be your highest ranking? Depends on budget and tao eh. yeah, if, the, if the person can <laughs> buy for, VUL. For, you, for, you. for me? Oh. Wala. <laughs> Pareho. Uh, <laughs> I don't subscribe to that eh. Okay. So I go with the budget of the person kasi. Okay. Like okay. for example, if the person can afford VUL because it rises over time, yung protection mo, then go for VUL. Pero kung for example, uh, yung monthly budget mo, hindi kaya or annual budget hindi kaya then go for term muna and for, then upgrade to VULA for someone na may investments na for what, someone na may investments oh, what do you na, recommend do they get do they still need to get a VUL or not anymore yeah they still need to get a VUL kasi at least is a protection insurance mo it grows over time and even grows after age 65 ang term kasi hanggang age 65 ka lang or 70 for some insurance so after no wala ka ng insurance so for estate planning protection the VUL masasalo niya yon kasi it grows even beyond tapos there's a, there's a, there's a view no, na it's better daw to get insurance in Singapore because the coverage is larger and yeah it's cheaper yeah but tingnan din nila I mean tingnan nila administration if they can kung paano yung ease of administration and claiming kung madali naman they no problem about it so okay. syempre dapat alamin nila yun so agree disagree Bitcoin, agree or disagree? 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 Scam, not scam? Uh, definitely uncharted territory. Will it, is it a bubble, yes or no? A bubble. It's a bubble. Oh. How low will it go? How low it will go? Uh, as long as wala lang naniniwala. <laughs> That's how, long it will, how low it will go. Ah... Uh, Start your own business. Personal or personal? Will you oh. start your own business or will you invest in mutual funds? Invest first in mutual funds. Invest in mutual funds. Why mutual funds? Uh, diversified. Like for example, if you invest in a mutual fund for 1,000 pesos, you have 30 stocks already. Okay. Oh. What, what's, your, what's your biggest money mistake? Biggest money mistake? Credit card. Bakit? When I was... Uh, ano pa ako? Single pa ron. Okay. Single pa. How old, are, how old are you? I'm 26. Yun, yun, yun totoo, yun totoo, yun totoo. Oh, yun totoo, yun totoo. Para ano, people can... Si Ryan, umami ng age eh. Yeah. Basta stop. Oh. Oh nga eh. I'm 36. 36. But I look... So 16 years working? Ah? Yeah. Biggest mistake in... My, but my metabolic age is 24. Biggest mistake, in, biggest mistake in 16 years? In 16 years, going to deep, deep debt in credit card. How, how big? How big? Okay lang ba? Okay lang as big as it can cause financial stress and okay. lack of sleep. Pero did it reach parang 500,000? Yeah. Ano? Okay. Definitely no. Pero yun, syempre kas-kas dito, kas-kas doon. So credit card talaga? Earning, yeah. So pero you were paying... Ah, money. another thing! Biggest mistake, uh, I... Lahat ng money ko nasa stock market. Lahat ng... Oh, bakit? Bakit naman? Mas nasasaktan ako dyan. Bakit naman? Because that was 2007 and then 2008 happened. Okay. Okay. So nangalaha all of my money were in the stock market. Okay. 2008 happened, nangalahat in portfolio. My wedding fund was there. I was set to get married 2009. Natuloy yung wedding. Natuloy naman. <laughs> Kasi Ma nag-recover ang market eh. Ma mahal ka naman. Mahal, oh, mahal sure, ka naman kahit ano, di ba? Ako ba? O, o, okay. And then during that time also, yung tatay ko na hospital for one week in PGH. 
Of course, it was not planned, and that was during recession time, and all of my money was in the stock market. So I was recovering losses. I was realizing losses. So I did not have to say to my mom, I can't give you because it's down in the stock market. So that was my biggest mistake, not diversifying and being too aggressive in my portfolio. Okay, at your age, how should you diversify? Uh, how should you diversify percentage-wise? Uh, no, it depends. Kasi you, you nga, for you, for you, for you. Percentage-wise? Oh. Where, where does Renzi Violena put his percentage allocations? Ilang percent sa stocks? I don't go for that. Okay, eh. mutual funds. <laughs> I don't go. I do gold-based investing, kasi. Okay. For example, uh, for goals within five or three years. Okay. Uh, kasi, nilala- what's 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 your five-year goal right now? Five-year goal right now to be a to be a billionaire like okay. Marvin Gaye. So how do you how do you, <laughs> how do you invest for it? Uh, money market for a five-year goal because it's short term. Money short-term market. For, yeah, because you really never know when a recession would happen. Pero nit no na. Because my priority is capital preservation. I need the money in the short term, five years or three years. Eh, eh kung magpalipad ng missile si North Korea kay US, okay. you'll never. So I'm on the prudent side. But anything more than that, pwede rin naman. Kaya lang, I'm risking it already. And I don't want to risk it because I need the money in three years time. Remember 2008 recession? Mm. It took the I was mark. 21 or okay. 16 ata nung recession. Oh, parang 17 lang ako. <laughs> okay. 2008 recession, the market took like two to three years bago siya mag-recover. Okay. So, if a recession happened at kailangan ko yung pera ko, you know, and it would take the market two to three years then, patay yung goal ko. Okay. Do you think at 8,200, we are near bubble territory for the PSE? I just, ano? What does uh, Tommy believe? It's just fair value. Okay. okay. Fair so value, 8,182. Are we expensive or cheap? Expensive historically. Lobat na ako, okay. Alam, okay, okay. Expensive historically, but ano naman, uh, it has its own fundamentals. So, it's ano naman. Okay pa. Kahit Fearless expensive. forecast, where will the index go? Fearless hey, forecast? Hey, hey. Wala bang fearful yeah, forecast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fearful forecast. <laughs> Oy, we're, we've been recharged. Brought to you by... Mr. Uh, Fitz Villaferte. Fitz Villaferte. <laughs> dot com. Mga 8-9 daw. 8-9? So far. So from the uh, analyst that I talk to and fund managers talk to, eight, index eight, end of the year forecast eight nine. Ah, he, ah for he, end of the year this year? Yeah, this year, this year. Eight one eight two. Okay, tax reform bill positive impact, negative impact for the market. Positive impact. Net, positive impact. Net positive impact. Okay, uh, Donald Trump positive negative. <laughs> <laughs> it's a work in progress. It's a work, work in progress. Okay. Uh, build, build, build. Will it help? Ah, yeah, oh, definitely. More, ano, more impetus for the economy. Okay. Oh, but why are cement sales down? Eh, baka wala pa masyadong project na naano, na na-up. So, PowerPoint pa lang yung build, build, build? PowerPoint presentation. PPP. PowerPoint, okay, PowerPoint presentation. PowerPoint presentation. Uh-huh. Okay. Still have yet to see some, ano, some projects. Uh, Biggest spending. Ano ba to? Ripari na ba to? Oh, biggest, biggest spending. Biggest spending. Me? Who? You? Uh, you. This, this Christmas. Biggest spending uh, for my wife and my kids. Okay, this Christmas? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so next. Uh, la- final tip. Final tip. Final tip for everyone. Final tip. Have a goal. Write down your goal and plan for it. And be very, very prudent with your money. Be very, very prudent with your money. Ah, wise, <laughs> wise words. Okay. Last na lang. Meron kang investment decision. Hmm. Pero ayaw ng wife mo, what will you do? Uh, we talk about it. Okay. And compromise. Ako kasi ano eh. Because marriage is about compromise. Ako yes dear eh. Hindi ako ganun kagwapo kaya uh, yes dear na eh. Oh, eh. Ikaw, ikaw may muscle. Ito may muscle. Sir, follow him. Gym ng gym yan. <laughs> Babaka-healthy lang. <laughs> oh, may babaka-healthy. Oh, so, ano sa mahalaga? Love life or investment? Ano? <laughs> love life. Uh, love life, syempre. Okay. Oh, ang investment pwede malugi eh. Ang love life, hindi nalulugi yan. Yeah. <laughs> saka parati may araw ay... <laughs> okay, okay. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Wow, 10.20 na. Last na. Last na. Thank you. I'd like to thank uh, Mr. Fitz Villaferte for this power bank. Natuloy yung ano natin, uh, Facebook Live, before we go to our last interviewee. Yes! Oh, oh save. Save the best for the one that has the largest net worth here. Yeah. Sino yun? Si Marvin? No, no, no. <laughs> Ako ba mag-interview sa'yo? No, no. So, uh, how much did you earn from... <laughs> from, 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 from... As a OFW. By the way, this is Chris Cervantes, best-selling author, RF 
Pami. <laughs> from Pami. A very, very good story. He was a OFW before, a seafarer. A captain? Yes. Earning how much? Okay, lang. can you share that? Ba? Okay, lang yan. Ah, bawal ba? Bawal ba? Baka habulin tayo ng BIR. Hindi, bayad naman. He follows proper taxes naman. Eh. So, okay lang. Hahabulin lang pag hindi. Pero, uh, the way he looks, okay na okay sa taxes natin. Yeah. Yes, that's good. Oo. So, uh, how long have you been a seafarer? 17 years. 17 years, wow. Oh, 17 years. Ito ang pinapanganak mo. Pero sige, okay, push natin itong idea na to. Okay, tapos. <laughs> Now, nakapasakin kuya. <laughs> okay, so 17 years. So, captain ka. Yes. yes. Uh, hmm. Ano yung biggest expense mo nun pag umuwi ka? Siguro sa loob na isang linggo, gagasos ka ng 500,000. 500,000? <laughs> wow, what was... Yun ang pinakamalaking pagkakamali. <laughs> okay, anong binili mo sa 500,000? What did you spend on for 500,000? Mga gamit sa bahay, mm-hmm. mga kung ano-ano. Okay. Uh, kasi parang iniisip mo noon na uh, uh, isang taon akong nawala, ngayon ko ibubuhos, parang ganun. Uh, Pero that happens to a lot of seafarers, no? Maliit pa yon actually. Oh, tipid pa yon Okay, tipid pa yon <laughs> Tipid pa yon mm. So, 500, ano yung naging turning point na sinabi mo? Sige nga, kailangan ko na mag-save, kailangan ko na mag- uh, set aside sa... Nung nakita ko na, ano, na karamihan ng mga OFWs, hindi lang mga seafarers, nakikita ko na pag-actively working silang ganda ng buhay. Pero the moment na nagsipag-retire sila, parang walang nangyayari. Parang ang lungkot nang nangyayari sa kanila. So sabi kong ganun, yun din ba ang gusto kong mangyari sa akin? So I think it's about time na baguhin ko yung mga uh, ginagawa ko na maaring yun din ang pagkakamali ng mga naon sa akin. Yun ang inaisip ko. Oh, okay, okay. I see. Nag-post na yung wife pa, sabi niya, inatok na daw siya, kailangan ko na daw siya sundin. <laughs> okay, let's, let's make this... Nagaantay na. Oh, let's make this video as uh, fast as we can. No? So, uh, Now, naka-uwi ka na. Very, very good story yan na as a OFW, as a seafarer, you're back in the Philippines already. Actually, ano, four years na akong hindi sumasakay ng barko. Okay. I finally said na enough is enough. Paano, paano ka naging, paano ka naka-uwi? Anong, anong naging steps mo? Actually, no, nung, uh, nung natutunan ko financial planning, that was uh, 10 years ago, ang ginawa ko, aral ako ng aral, then naging RFP ako, then sabi kong ganun, I have to do something na maaaring hindi ginawa ng mga nauna sa amin. So, doon ko sinimulan ng financial planning. Then, in a matter of 7 years, nagawa ko siyang tumitin. Nagkautang ka ba? Wala? Wala. No, no debt? No debt. Mm. Okay, savings. K- Kaya nag-start lumaki yung savings natin? So, siguro nung mga 30 years old ako. Okay. Mm. How, sorry, how old are you now? 42. 42, so 12 mm. years of steady saving already. Mm-hmm. First investment? First investment property. Property saan? Uh, somewhere in Bulacan. Okay. Bah- bahay? Bahay? No, uh, agri, uh, agri, agri lot. Farm. Okay. Farm is lot. your Is your house an investment? No. No, not not an investment. <laughs> Why? Kasi sabing ganun ang investment daw kumikita. Ang bahay hindi naman kumikita, gumagasos to eh. Okay. Hmm. Should people buy an expensive condo? Para saan? Depende, no? So, depende. Kung, kung yan ay magiging negosyo, why not, no? Okay, but kung titirahan nila yung condo, mahal na... 18 million condo in BGC. Kung, mas, kung masyado ka na humihiga sa pera, okay lang yun. Pero kung nagsisimula pa lang, hindi tama. Okay. Should... Ah, to, to, very interesting question. Uh, magka, mag, magkakaroon, ng, magkakaroon ng tax reform bill. Uh, Should people buy... A car right now, habang mura pa yung mga kotse? Hindi, kasi parang parehas din lang ng sale yan eh. Nasabi mo nga 50% off ngayon. Actually, hindi ka nakasave ng 50%. Gumasos ka ng 50%. Parang ganun din ang konsepto niyan. Unless talagang kailangan mo siya. So, not, okay not, siya. not advisable to buy a car? Again, depende kung kailangan. Pero kung, kung para lang sabihin para lang, na para lang... ma- ma- makahabol, no. Okay. Mm. Oh. Ah. Now, ngayon, stocks, mutual fund. First, both. Both. Mm. If you drank it, stocks, mutual fund? Stocks. Stocks. Mm. Real estate, stocks? Stocks. Forex, stocks? Stocks. Stocks din. Uh, uh, Bitcoin, stocks? Stocks. Stocks, insurance? Both. both. Insurance at the beginning. Okay. Mm. Uh, start your own business or franchise? Start your own business. Why? Kasi, um... na doon ka natututo, magkamali ka man, at least uh, nakita mo yung sistema. No? And uh, 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 iba yung, iba yung, ano, iba yung uh, ikaw ang nagsimula eh. 
iba yun. Kasi ganun din naman eh. Either nagsimula ka o nag-franchise ka, kung nagkamali ka ng ginawa, lugi pa rin naman eh. So might as well nagawa mo yung dapat mong gawin. Biggest financial mistake. Yun nga, nung gumasas ng ganun kalaki sa lobby. 500,000. See, comment below if you spend 500,000 also ha, within that period of time. 500,000. Uh, best investment that you've ever done so far? Siguro ano, uh, nung hindi investment, nung ma-manage ko ang aking portfolio. Okay. Mm. Mean, meaning, what does that mean? What does that meaning, mean? uh, nung naayos ko yung finances ko na meron ako nasa stocks, meron insurance, meron pang retirement. Kasi uh, ako, dumating na ako sa point na hindi naman ito palagi tungkol sa stocks, hindi lang ito tungkol sa investment. Uh, ano ang gusto mo mangyari in the future na maayos mo yung pera mo? Yun ang mas importante sa akin ngayon. Okay. As a seafarer, mm. What's a good amount na pwede na sila umuwi na pwede sa monthly na expenses dito na makaretire na din sila? What's a good amount that they should save for a month na expenses? At least dapat meron kang good for 3 years. Okay. Three good years. for 3 years. Oo. Okay na siya. Napagsimula. So is, is 50,000 a month okay? Mga 600,000 a year? So 1.8 million or kulang? Good enough. Pero hindi siya ano. Kung may sisimulan kang panibago dito sa lupa. Transition ba? Okay. For yung 3 years na ano na na savings. Uh, enough na yun to, for you to ano. Uh, para lumipat ng industry na let's say magnegosyo or mag-change ng career, enough na yun. Ano dapat magbago sa mga seafarers natin ngayon? I think yung mindset sa pera. Kasi yung pera nandyan eh, nandyan yung pera eh. Kaya lang, ano yung tingin nila sa pera? In, hindi lang seafarers, no? Even their families. Yun ang pinaka-importante. Kasi pa family ang pag reason kung bakit sila umaalis. Family rin ang papabalik sa kanila. Very good word. Yun din ba naging motivation mo, family mo? Yes. And in fact, no, kung hindi, hindi ako makakatigil sa pagbabar ko kung hindi ako tinulungan ng maganda ng kasawa. Mm, very, very so, good word. Uh, family is very important. What will you spend on this Christmas? Siguro, ano, pahinga. Pahinga? <laughs> pahinga. Oy, libre yan, ha? Okay yan. <laughs> oh, at least. Pero baka pahinga ka sa solar ka magpapahinga. <laughs> Mahal dun. <laughs> so, siguro, ano, um, family getaway. Family getaway. Okay. Uh, one one tip for everyone that's listening to us right now. I think no, uh, lagi nyo isipen na kung ano man ang kinikita nyo ngayon hindi yan pang habang buhay. Forever. So, so lagi nyo isipen na what if tomorrow mawala ang akin trabaho? Ilang taon na ako mabubuhay? Okay. So uh, yun lang yun lang palagi nating paghahandaan. And dalawa lang ang importanteng responsibility natin sa buhay. Una, mapag-aral mong anak mo. O pangalawa, is maghanda ka ng pera sa pagtanda mo. Then the rest bonuses na. Paano yung mga walang love life? Kasama yun, ano? Kasama. <laughs> so, dapat humanap ka ng makakasama sa buhay. No? Ah, okay. So, for example, paano yung kapatid ko? Wala pa rin, nag, wala pa rin love life. Paano yun? <laughs> Gulpi ka pag uwi mo. <laughs> okay, okay. That's it. Let me greet. Uh, uh, Merry Let Christmas. Me... Oh, greet muna natin to Mga tao, pakigreet naman. No? Sandali, Ako, dami. Ako, hindi ko mabasa yung pangalan. Oh, dami sila. Naharangan ng ating camera. Okay, si Marvin Dunga, oh, very great entrepreneur. Hello, Camille Cos. Ito, si Jamie. Well, hello, Dimakali. Jamie. Oh, ito, mm. Carlo. Biglang, Biglang awa. awa. Very, Carlo, hello. Merry very Christmas. Very inspirational daw. Oh. Mm. Oh, Byron Laro. Mm. Bethany Barrios from Malaysia. Jemmy Lonto. Wow, hello. Malaysia. Oh, Nanette. Fan siya ni Fitz. So, idol Fitz daw. June Hairstyle. Mm. Sabi niya, Lodi. <laughs> uh, Gerla Toledo, good evening. Si June. June. Oh, pumayat ka daw. Pumayat, oh, talaga. Oh, pumayat daw. Pumayat. <laughs> Berhel <laughs> Barreto. Mm. Hector Cabus. Uh, Abby Cabigas. Josh Campos. Trisha Torres. Fit, sabi niya, nagustuhan daw niya in the intern. Yeah, so much greetings. I won't be able to greet all of you, ha, pero thank you so much for Merry joining Christmas. us. Actually, impromptu lang to. No, uh, napili, napilitan lang. Hindi na, na, naman ako napilitan, pero wala lang. Masaya lang din kasi I don't see them as often. So, I hope you guys learned a lot from from their tips and their uh, things that they do. No? Yun yung maganda. For, to, you surround yourself with People, people that are like this, no? oh, people that are like-minded, because you will only go as far as uh, the people you surround yourself with. Eh. So uh, that's it. More videos in the next few days. Uh, nasa ba ako? Uh, Stock Smarts, oh, Ortiga, Stock Smarts this Saturday. See you all there. So uh, that's all. God bless you, uh, Yvonne. I'm coming home. <laughs> I'll pick you up now. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye, everyone. Wala na, wala na, wala na. Wala na, wala na. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Si Sir Henry. Oo nga eh, wala eh. Watching lang eh. Oh, thank you sa steak ah. Nasuportahan yung keto, keto diet ko. Yeah. I guess that's it, that's it, that's it. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Okay na. Yeah. Buta tayo sa ano? Pero mako nung, ay tapos ka na sa power bank.
Ay, okay. Ah, ganun ba? Okay, bye-bye.